What's up you guys? It's Brooke. So for now, let's all enjoy this view. Yeah, we live. Today we are doing a pretty little thing haul. More like a mini one. Because it is spring, I wanted to buy new clothes and I wanted to get kind of new clothes that I normally don't get. So I just wanted to uh, try something new. Um, I wasn't able to buy everything that I wanted because the price came out to like $300. So I bought about half of what was on my wish list and the total came out to 200 and something dollars. And then when I applied the 50% discount, it went down to um, 100 dollars and then plus tax and shipping it came out to 110. Okay to start this off we are starting with a plain black oversized t-shirt with um, the Eiffel Tower in Paris on the back. Um, if you know me I am obsessed with Paris and London and the Eiffel Tower and everything so I had to get this and I liked how it was only on the back and not on the front so you know, you can be like, oh yeah, I'm playing just kidding. And you turn around and you're like, you know. Next, I got these gray jogger sweatpant type things. I think these are more sweatpants than joggers. Actually, I don't even know the difference. So I got these in a size small. The color is ash gray. And I honestly, I have like zero sweatpants. And I just, I need more sweatpants in my life. And you can never go wrong with a nice gray jogger because they are so comfortable you can wear them literally anywhere so I'm super excited about these because oh my god they're so soft inside next I got this plain black hoodie because I don't have any like plain black hoodies I wanted a solid color that I can just throw on with leggings or a pair of jeans and it will just be good you know there's nothing too crazy going on so this is, um, once again, supposed to be oversized, so I got a size small. I got a size small, and it looks like it will fit me pretty okay, um, but when, yeah, it is supposed to be oversized, so I just kept it at a size small. If it wasn't supposed to be an oversized, I would have gotten a size medium. So yes, it's just plain black with drawstrings, and I love it. Okay, next I got biker shorts just because, I don't know, I've always loved the whole biker short style and I thought it was super cute how you can just throw like on an oversized t-shirt like the Paris one or a sweatshirt or even a crop top. Like I feel like it can go with anything and it's just like, it's so cute. I love it. But I always thought that I wouldn't look good in them. Um, but I was like, you know what, let's just try it. If you don't like it, you can return it. So yeah. So I just got plain black ones. I got a size small. The thing I'm kind of worried about, can you see that? It, it's see-through. So I'm scared that if I put them on, they're gonna be see-through. <laughs> I'm really hoping that's not the case because that's not what I want. Um, so yeah, I'm hoping they fit and I'm hoping it's not see-through because I don't want that. All right, next we have bathing suits. So I was looking at their bathing suit section and they are so cute. I only got two, um, but I will be getting some more. Um, so the first one is black and then the second one is neon green because I've always wanted to have a neon bathing suit and I was like, neon pink or neon green? I went with neon green just because I feel like it would look better on me. I don't really know why. So I got that and I'm super excited for them. Here are the black bottoms. The black bottoms are high-waisted, which I really liked, so that's why I got them. I don't have um, high-waisted bikini bottoms, and I really wanted to try them out just because I feel like they look super um, flattering. And then this is the front. Um, by the way, both of the bikinis I got are um, mix-and-match bikinis, so I actually got the lime mix and match cheeky bum bottom and then the top that it came with it was kind of just like a straight across top and i didn't really like it so i chose a different top oh there's no pads that's so small i chose a different top um which is the triangle top the triangle bikini top in the same exact color just because i didn't like the original top that came with these bottoms so yeah this again is in a size four 
Um, this has no padding, neither does the other one, but the other one, the material felt a little more thicker. Um, if anything, because there are two, um, it's two-sided material, I would just cut a hole in it and add padding myself because this material also feels very thin, so I would want some type of padding. Hi, you guys. Okay, so I told you that I still had a couple more bathing suits coming in from Pretty Little Thing, and they just arrived. I'm sorry, I have no makeup on right now. They just arrived, so I wanted to show you guys and add it to this haul. I'm so excited because they look so cute. I got one white one and one animal print because I am obsessed with animal print bathing suits. Okay. So the white one has, it's like a ribbed material and it has buttons um, on the bottom and on the top. So I'll show you what that looks like. Oh, that is tiny. Okay, so as you can tell, it looks like this. That's the material. It's ribbed. It has really cute buttons. And this is the back. Super cheeky, as you can tell. And this is the top. Oh, it's not padded. That makes me so sad because like because it's white and it's not padded if it gets wet like I would think that it would be see-through you know so this is the top Ooh, it's really thin material I thought it would be a lot like thicker and kind of just like these ones are unbuttonable so like you could totally just go like that and you know kind of make it cute um the material seems very it's very thin and it's just not like swimsuit material all right so the animal print bikini i got the bottoms high-waisted this bikini is a mix and match bikini so i just chose different bottoms and a different top so these are the bottoms which are so cute this is swimsuit material um extremely stretchy around the waist which i really like and the top is a triangle bikini to pair with the high-waisted bottoms just like how i got the black bathing suit that i just showed you guys um so you just tight here tight here these are not padded i think like a lot of their bathing suits are just not padded uh i don't i personally don't like unpadded bathing suits but yeah so that's what it looks like and i'm so excited for these i really hope they look cute and they fit um so i just wanted to remind you that i will be returning the um the neon green bikini bottoms because they were extremely small they were so small on me the material was very just like it wasn't stretchy at all and you just couldn't move in it and i stretched it out a lot when i was trying to fit it over my butt and i will be returning the biker shorts because oh, i'm so mad about that because they were so cute they are so see-through i'm pretty sure you can see that when i try them on because i like ooh, they were so see-through so i will be returning that so that is all i have for you guys today thank you so much for watching and i really hope you enjoyed it let me know if you have any uh questions and comment them down below this was only half of what I wanted, so expect to see another Pretty Little Thing haul coming up soon when I am able to afford the other half. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and thank you so much for watching, and I will hope to see you guys soon.